You know, it takes a little time to toss that off. Because they weren't just men. For instance, one time it had been raining several days and this kid came to me. He gave me his last pair of dry socks. Put them in my pocket. That's only a small thing, but that's the type of guys I had. They didn't die. They killed themselves for each other. I mean that exactly. A little more selfish than they would have been here today. And then I got an idea. Watching them go down. Everything was being destroyed. See? But it seemed to me that one new thing was being created. A kind of responsibility. Man for man. You understand that? To show that. To bring that on the earth again like some kind of monument. And everybody would feel it standing there behind him. And it would make a difference to him. Then I came home. And it was incredible. I, there was no meaning in it here. The whole thing to them seemed like a kind of a bus accident. I went back to work with Dad in the rat race again. And I felt... They said, ashamed somehow, because nothing was changed at all. I felt wrong to be alive, to, to open up the bank book, to drive the new car, to see the new refrigerator. I mean, you can take those things out of a war, but when you drive that car, you gotta know that it came out of the love a man can have for a man. You gotta be a little better because of that. Otherwise, what you have is really loot. And there's blood on it. any of it. 